Hi, this is Pastor Steve with an encouraging word. Do you like your name? I found some people really love their name and some people seem ambivalent about their name and others don't like their name. I know I was not feeling that excited about my name, Stephen. I wasn't a junior named after my dad until I found out what Stephen meant. Stephen is from the Greek word Stephanos, which means kingly or crowned one. I'm sure you can see that in me. And suddenly I felt pretty special to know my name meant kingly. Some of us had nicknames growing up, names family members or friends gave us because of a trait we might have had or, or just for many of us, kind of a shortened form of our name. I know if you go around my family to this day, you'll hear me called Stevie. A lot of people may have been called Susie or Billy or Ricky, that same E kind of ending known by family is a special way. I know each of our daughters had a nickname growing up. Again, it was mainly a family name given to them, and again, it's because they were special. They were important to us. We loved them very, very much. You know that God feels the same way about us? Now, we know in the Bible that Jesus changed the name of his, some of his disciples. We know that Peter was Cephas until Jesus changed his name to Peter, which we might translate Rocky today. Rocky sounds pretty good for a guy, doesn't it? Strong and firm. We know that John, the gospel writer, the disciple of Jesus, was so taken by the fact that Jesus called him beloved, that he called himself beloved. And so he is throughout his gospel, the gospel of John. But God wants to know each of us intimately because he loves us very much. Each of us are special to God. Again, because he loves us so much. And it's interesting to find the book of Revelation, one of my favorite verses, is found in the second chapter in verse 17. Let me read it for you. He who has an ear, let him hear what the Spirit is saying to the churches. To the one who overcomes, I'll give some hidden manna, and I'll give him a white stone with a new name on it, known only to him who receives it. The God says he's going to give each of us a white stone, with a new name on it, a name only he and each one of us who receive that white stone will know, a special pet name, if you would, a special name that God calls us, maybe because he knows us so well. He sees something inside us that we may miss sometimes. God has a new name for us, a, a nickname, if you would, and because we're so special to God, each one of us, it'll be known only to God and to us. I hope you realize how special you are to God. Whether you like your name or not, God calls you indeed beloved and his child and his chosen one. And in some day in heaven, he'll call you a new name, a name only you and he will share, kind of a, a private joke, a private relationship, a private love from this God who loves us so much. This is a word of encouragement from Pastor Steve.